Hi, uh, in this tutorial I'm going to show you how to make this mushroom fairy house light. It's made just using a solar powered light bulb garden thingy, one of these. They're usually to hang up in your garden. They're solar powered so you don't need batteries. They just switch on and there's lights on the inside. I'm just going to decorate this to make it look like a mushroom house. So obviously you're going to need one of these bulbs. You can also get them from garden centres and other places as well, not just Poundland. And I'm going to just take some masking tape, you know, like the normal painter's tape, the one that's not overly sticky. And I'm just going to cut out some shapes for some windows, because I don't want those to be painted, I want those to be see-through and let the light from the inside through. So I'm just going to cut out some oval shapes and then some round shapes just to make a few different sizes for the windows. So this is a bit tricky because obviously it's sticky. But it's well worth doing properly. So I'm going to stick these all around the outside of the bulb. And make sure they're firmly down. Then next I'm going to take a large plastic bottle and this I'm going to make like the top of the mushroom now. So I'm just going to chop off the top of this. So I'm going to get a hobby knife just to pierce a hole. Then grab, grab some scissors and just cut around the top. Be careful when you do this because the plastic does become quite sharp. And you want to try and get it as straight as possible. So we'll just do that and then we're going to spray paint all of this because you can't really paint plastic but I found if you use spray paint on it first it's easier to then paint over it with like acrylic paints and stuff or any normal paints you've got at home. So I've chopped that off and now I'm going to do um, like make another little hole and cut off like that spelty bit because you don't want that either. Okay, so next I'm going to spray paint both things, both the bulb and the plastic bottle with this felt bit already cut off. This one looks like when it's done. Then I'm just going to peel back that tape that I put on there and it should leave a nice clear space and these are going to be the windows. You know, some of the paint leaked over slightly, but when it dries completely, I can just scratch that off. So now I'm going to start painting with acrylic paints. So now it's just paint it how you want. So I'm going to start off with the windows. I'm going to make it look like there's a wooden window frame on it. I'm going to do some like plants cl climbing up at the side. Basically, whatever you want to do, just paint it with acrylic paints or poster paints. I'm not the best painter but <laughs> then I'm just going to do red with white spots for the top part and that's all that's left to do is to pop that on top and then you're done. So if you want this outside and you've used normal paints you want to like put a clear coat in spray clear coat and have some sort of varnish on top otherwise it will just kind of run in the rain. So next just put the lights on, put the lid back on and that's it you're done. There's your little house it looks like as fairies are having a little party inside. <laughs> so I hope you enjoyed this video. Thanks for watching. As usual if you make this share a picture and you can be featured on my website. Thanks again. Bye.